no see. Summer's been a bit crazy up in here. Let me tell you that. So I'm sorry you haven't seen me in a in a hot minute, but you'll see in me now. And we are gonna do a favorites video. I'm gonna share with you all my beauty, lifestyle, body care, skin care, and other favorites that were my very favorite products that I used in the month of June. And I have some wonderful products, a very uh, plethora, a cornucopia of goodies, if you will. And it's a mix. There's some fun lifestyle products in there too. So let me dive in and show you what I got. All right, girls, the first product is an antioxidant vitamin C serum. This is the cockadoo, just fun to say, isn't it? From Derma Doctor, it is 20% vitamin C serum with frulic acid and vitamin C. And you know what it does? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna tell you, it defends your skin from antioxidants and sun damage and all that junk, free radicals, all those nasties that are floating around, it's gonna protect your skin from that. And what I also see is it actually helps alleviate some of those nasty sunspots that I have. So I've been using a vitamin C serum since I turned 40, so <laughs> for several years, and I can't live without it. I've gone a few months in my lifetime without using it, and my skin started looking splotchy and ragged. I mean bad. So I don't want to go without it again. Now this is a new vitamin C serum. I was using the SkinCeuticals, which is about $50 more than this. So, ouch! So I'm now trying this one. I've been using it for a couple weeks and uh, I think it's basically the exact same thing in a cheaper price. So, woohoo! I've been loving it so far and it's been a favorite of mine. All right, the next favorite of mine you probably are already familiar with if you saw that very, very scary video where I applied it on my no makeup skin. You could be still traumatized by that. It is scary to see Miss Nikki without makeup. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But the favorite, of course, is the L'Oreal Lumi True Match Lumi Cushion Makeup. And this is a cushion foundation brought to you by those wonderful folks in Japan who come up with those wonderful innovations. Mm -hmm. And your foundation is right in there. And you just squish the little sponge there with your brush or your beauty blender or whatever you want and you pop it on your skin. This has been amazing. It's been giving me light to full coverage and I have been loving it. I have the color uh, W2. If you want to see more and you want to see an application, I will link the video. Um, it's about two videos back of where I apply this, but it does come with a warning. If it doesn't, it should that you are about to see this face with no makeup on and it's not pretty. So bear with me on that, but it is an interesting video and it shows you how this applies. So check it out, but it's been a favorite. And the next favorite of mine is Yes to Coconuts. This is the Hydrate and Restore Ultra Hydrating Melting Cleanser. Well, mama loves her a good melting cleanser. As you know, I am a huge, huge fan of the cleansing balms. I have used just about everybody's brand and they're usually quite, quite, quite expensive. The last one I used was the Colleen Rothschild's one and it was about $65. Although I loved it and it felt like a spa in a bottle and I just loved putting it on, um, yeah, 65 bucks is a little pricey. So I found this little baby, which is under $10. Yes, yes, yes. Now I looked at my Target and I looked at my Walgreens and I looked at my Walmart, I could not find it. Finally found it at Ulta Beauty, and it is the same, basically the same thing. It is a solid, more like a solid, like an oil, uh, what, what should I say? It is a solid. It comes out like this. Let me show you. See that? It's just like a solid little, ooh, little balm, and um, it's almost like, this is kind of a gel, but it's, but it's definitely a solid, and when you put it on your face, you emulsify it, and it kind of turns a little bit more liquidy. But what it does do is the solid uh, thickness allows it to get into your pores real, real good and get all that makeup out. So it says it has virgin coconut and moringa seed oils to help melt away makeup, and it is phenomenal at getting my makeup off. I've been really, really pleased with it. Mmm, it smells like the most delicious coconut you've ever tried, and I love it. And for under 10 bucks, it's been a great way to remove my makeup. All right, the next favorite of mine is a uh, mascara, and it is the Clinique High Impact Extreme Volume Mascara. It's wonderful. I read some reviews on this, and someone said, girl, you gotta try this Clinique High Volume Impact Mascara. And I said, all right, so I went to the Clinique counter, I bought it. I think this was around $18. 
but I love it. It does a great job of not only separating the lashes, but really giving you some volume, and that's what I need. So I've got some super fine white lashes. So Mama needs all the help she can get in the mascara department, and I find that this not only separates the lashes, but really gives some A plus a volume. I'm wearing it today. Um, you know, my eyes and my lashes are not the best uh, judge of good lashes. I don't wear falsies. They're not big and long. They're not beautiful in any way, shape, or form, but they're good enough. They're good enough for me. So I have been loving this, and um, it comes off easy as well. Uh, I don't think it's waterproof. No, it's not waterproof, but I do find that it stays all day, and I don't find any clumping under there. So woohoo! We have a winner in my book. So this has been a favorite for me. The next favorite of mine should come as no surprise if you watched any of my videos and you know that I am a nude lip girl. Well, this is my nude lipstick for the month of June. I have been loving it for almost every day, and it is the MAC Cream Sheen Cream Cup. And I have loved it. Here's what it looks like. Ooh, it's so pretty. I'm going to swatch it for you here because it is beautimous. And it is the color that I'm wearing today, but there it is swatched as well. Gorgeous, right? Oh my goodness. It's so pretty. It's so nice. Um, I love MAC lipsticks, the formula, especially the cream sheen because I find that they're very hydrating and mm, it smells like a vanilla cupcake. Could you ask for anything more? Seriously. Vanilla cupcake? Yeah. All right. Now the next favorite of mine is a blush. It's also a MAC product. I guess I've been a MAC lover for the month of June and it is the a beautiful sheer tone blush in Gingerly. Here's what it looks like. It's gorgeous. I'm going to swatch it for you as well. It gives you the most beautiful sun-kissed glow. There it is right there. Just a nice warm glow on the cheeks. Almost just a sun-kissed look. Very, very natural. I do have it on today. And I've been loving it. It's been a favorite of mine for many, many years. But I just pulled it out for the month of June and it's been rocking. Alright, the next favorite of mine has quickly become a holy grail favorite. And it is the Anastasia Eyeshadow Palette in Modern Renaissance. Oh my goodness, this is the most unique, beautiful eyeshadow palette that I've seen in a long, long time. <laughs> Little Butterfingers action there. Whoopsie! Let me show you right up close these colors because they are to die for. Can you see that? Look at it. Just look at it. <laughs> Very unique colors that you don't see often. Um, I've been loving this Venetian Red, I've been loving the Red Ochre, the Burnt Orange, very unique, unique, unique colors. It's a good balance of mattes and shimmers, and the shimmers are not too shimmery, so I've been loving it. I am wearing it today. Again, I like a very nude look. I'm wearing the Tempura mixed with the Golden Ochre with a little bit of Primavera, this little shiny shimmery one um, right on the eye base, and a little tiny, tiny bit of raw sienna in the crease. I don't know if you can tell, but it's been working great for me. I love it. I'm going to swatch a couple of the colors so you can see how smooth and beautiful they are. We have the Realgar right here, the Red Ochre right here, and the Raw Sienna right there. And as you can see, they are like butter. They're super smooth and creamy, no fallout, and I've been loving that entire palette. I believe it ran $48, um, but I'll put the price below. And I've loved it. I picked mine up at Ulta. They also have it at Sephora, but if you are looking for a gorgeous palette, that you will pick up day after day after day, definitely check that one out. All right, let's go to uh, my next favorite, which you may remember from last summer. It is a fragrance. This is the a Replica Cologne in Beach Walk. And Replica Colognes and Perfumes are made to replicate certain locations or certain activities. And they do it perfectly. There's like a jazz concert, there's a Paris garden, and this one is the beach walk. It smells perfect. It smells like a day at the beach. You get a little bit of sea salt in there and some coconut, pineapple, a little bit of sunscreen, and then a tiny sweetness too. That might be some lily or something like that, but it is beautiful. It's been my favorite uh, cologne for the summer and I love it. And another favorite of mine is kind of a lifestyle favorite, but it is the Arbonne Aroma Essentials Unwind Rejuvenating Mist. 
Now, I had a few days in June that were a little stressful and um, work was getting crazy and everything was going on in the family and I could not get to sleep. You know how when you lay down and you're trying to sleep but everything that you've done that day or everything that you need to do the next day is just rolling through your head and you cannot unwind and just turn off. This was a lifesaver for me and it is a just a rejuvenating mist. It can be a mist for your bedding, your pillows, you can spray it on your clothes, your towels, whatever. But I used this in the evening and I would just spray my pillows and I'd lightly spray my sheets. Relax and calm your mind, body, and spirit with this botanically based all over a body and room mist designed to hydrate the skin and hair, imparting the lifting aromatherapeutic benefits of the Unwind Essential Oil Blend. I have no idea what the Unwind Essential Oil Blend is, but I do know that there's some lavender in there because I really smell the lavender. And I have been loving this and, and it's really helped me get to sleep. It's helped me calm down and unwind. I know you can purchase this from an Arbonne uh, seller. I don't even remember where I got this, but I'm so glad I found it. All right, the next product is also a lifestyle product and I purchased this at Target. This is the Sandalwood Citrus Azum Mist Aromatherapy Room and Body Mist. It's another room and body mist, very similar to the last one but this smells kind of like a sexy man. I really like it. Like a sexy man in a spa. That's what it smells like to me. But it has been a lifesaver. I not only spray it on my body um, when I get out of the shower sometimes, but we took it on vacation and we went and stayed at a hotel in San Antonio and it was a great hotel, don't get me wrong, but it smelled like a hotel. You know how sometimes they can smell just a little funky? I don't know, it, it was just a little odd. And I sprayed our room with this and I sprayed our beds with this and boom, all the funky little hotel smell was all gone. <laughs> so this has really helped. Maybe it just made me feel like home. I'm not sure because this hotel didn't really smell bad. It just didn't smell right, you know what I mean? But this really helped it. And like I said, I purchased this at Target. I believe it was under $10. And um, let's see real quick. Oh yeah, oh yeah, it smells fresh. I smell the sandalwood. I smell a little masculine and then spa, like maybe eucalyptus or something that keeps the smell smelling very fresh. So I love this. They had several different flavors. I chose the sandalwood citrus and I'm loving it. I've got two products left and they are lifestyle products. The first product is my new Sip by Swell water bottle. Oh my goodness, this is my baby. I, I even take it to bed with me, I kid you not. This is the best water bottle I've ever found in my life. My kids got me this uh, for Mother's Day. They purchased it at Target. Swell is usually around $30 for their bottles, but they did a special line for Target, and I believe it's, it's the Sip line by Swell, and it's a little cheaper. I think that line is between uh, $20 and $24.99. There's different sizes and things. I love this. This stuff keeps my water so cold, so cold. I will put ice water in this at night because I've got to have my water next to my bed and I will drink it and then I will wake up the next morning and it is still icy cold like nothing ever happened. I can check it 24 hours later and the ice may have melted but the water's still ice cold. I don't know how it does it. I don't know if there's some magical thing in here. I have no clue that keeps this stuff so so cold, but I have loved it. And um, I got the little bumblebee pattern. Isn't that cute? Yes, yes, yes. But there's lots of other patterns as well, and I've been loving this. It has literally been a favorite of mine. The last product I wanna share with you, you probably already know about this, but I figured I'd share it in case you didn't. It is the Coca-Cola Life. This is my beverage of choice, oh my goodness. My kiddos call it the Hulk Cola because it's green. <laughs> but it is a reduced calorie cola. It has 35% fewer calories than regular Coca-Cola and it is sweetened with, with cane sugar and stevia. Now this has just 60 calories in a bottle compared to the Coke, which obviously has 35% more. <laughs> you do the math, it's summer, my brain's off. But I don't like, uh, really, I'm not a huge fan of the taste of Diet Coke or Diet Drinks. I still like my Coke to taste like Coke, but I found a way to cut the calories and still get that delicious Coke flavor. I personally love it in the bottles, but it also comes in cans. 
I have found it at Super Target, not our regular Target, but Super Target carries it and our Kroger carries it. And you can get it in a six pack of the bottles or a 12 pack of the cans. It's a little bit more pricey, I believe, but um, it's wonderful and it's well worth it. For 60 calories, I've been just loving this. So check you out some coconuts. <laughs> All right, I lied. I have one more favorite that I'm going to show you, and it is actually what I'm wearing. It's a shameless plug for my jewelry line, Adorn, but I have been loving in the summer the tribal-inspired jewelry, very boho chic, and I love the vintage kind of antique gold. I'm going to show you here what I have going on that I just recently made, and it is this particular a necklace, very kind of tribal-esque, and I have it layered with a t-shirt, a lariat like this, and this is a good little piece. You can kind of tuck it down your t-shirt and it looks all cute and sexy if you had something there to make it look sexy, which you don't. But I layer it with this one and then this one here is just a little bell. And I love the three pieces layered. It's really, really cute. And these will be on my Instagram page. You can purchase them directly off my Instagram page. But um, I've been loving these and I love the little bell because it makes me sound like a cat. <laughs> I definitely sound like one of my cats roaming the house. But I really, really like it. And um, like I said, if you're interested, I'll put my Instagram link below and you can PayPal me and I'll pop that in the mail to you. There you go. Those are my favorites for the month of June. I hope you guys have been having a wonderful summer. I'm sorry I've been a little bit missing in action. It's been crazy and um, tomorrow my husband and my youngest son actually are going to be competing in the fencing national competition and it's usually in different places throughout the United States but actually this year it's here in Dallas so we were able to attend and my husband's competing and my youngest is competing so it's a big deal so it's been crazy around here everybody getting ready polishing their swords and all that <laughs> go figure and I do hope you've had a wonderful summer so far and I'll see you real soon in the next video Thanks so much, everyone. Bye-bye.